Hello everyone, it's Mike, the CEO of the Useless Duck Company. It's Christmas Eve, and I thought it would be nice to answer some questions from some of my viewers. First, a quick update about the wireless baby crib that I put online. The video was uploaded to Facebook, where it received 1.2 million views. It was turned into a GIF that was shared on Imager, which received 2.6 million views. On my YouTube channel, it got about 52,000 views. So I need to think of a way to get people to come check my channel out so they watch it there. What I really want to do is grow the amount of subscribers I have so I can start making projects much more often than what I've been doing. But I'm still excited that people are really interested in the baby crib. I have an extra addition that I'd like to make, an attachment, but I'm holding off right now because I was contacted by a TV show here in Canada that might be interested in filming the crib. And the next addition I want to add to it will destroy it. So I'm going to hold off on that one. Okay, let's get into the questions. On my useless wireless hat video, where I made a hat that tips and says "Milady," a few users had the same questions. Uh, Schmugger Butter Bros ask, where can I buy Black Anthem product? Where can I buy one? A lot of people seem to want to buy the hat. So you'll be happy to know, I actually went and patented the hat. Uh, it's the first patent I've ever had on an invention that I've made, and I was pretty excited about that. I want to sell the hat as an electronics kit. So not only do you have a hat that tips when you press a button and you can change the voice so it says something other than milady, but people would be able to take it apart and make other electronics projects out of it. Let's say you press a button and it flips a light switch because really the whole thing is a little servo that moves the hat around. I emailed some companies like ThinkGeek and stuff like that, but I got no response. So I'm still trying to figure out uh, how to find a partner to help me make that hat. On my useless toilet paper video, I received a similar question from Nico Supra, who asked, where can I order this? Well, Nico, the toilet paper machine I did not patent, and I'm not selling currently because I'm afraid it's a little bit too dangerous and I don't want to get sued. As you can see here in the video, there's an electric motor that turns the toilet paper, and anytime you have an electric motor this close to the wall, there's a hazard of fire. So I'm holding this one off on the market until I can think of something a little bit safer. Also on the toilet paper machine, I received uh, a lot of this question, like from Paku Tote, is your toilet in your kitchen? And people would also ask, why is there a toilet in your kitchen? And that's a very good question. In my incognito lock video, which I made to lock the door so your wife doesn't walk in when you're looking at something online that you don't want her to see, user Oceaneaser asked, fuck, this is awesome. That's actually not a question, but I do appreciate that. Popular Mechanics wrote an article about the baby crib, which was pretty cool. When they posted the article to Facebook, a user had a question. Colleen Nielsen said, seriously? And the answer is yes. If you guys have more questions, go ahead and add them as comments to this video, and I will reply to them in the next vlog. Also, if you have any ideas about how to get people to actually watch the video rather than just the GIF, uh, I'm interested in what your thoughts are there. And happy holidays, everybody.